Hello, welcome to Crafting Kitty. My name is Erin and I went to Michael's. So what we're going to open today is this box from Michael's. Why did I go to Michael's? I have an experiment going on my Addy and I thought I had enough yarn for it and I did not. So I ran out. So it's been stuck on my Addy because I refuse to try to take it off and then figure out how to get it back on because that seems... That seems too complicated. So, the Addy has been out of commission while they waited for this order. Why did I need to go to Michael's? Because I was using their um, Craft Smart yarn, which I know they don't have anymore, but it's their uh, Soft Classic now. So I needed to get some Soft Classic. And while I was there, there were some yarns marked as new that I did not recognize. So, I went ahead and got them. And we'll see. I don't know if they are truly new or if they're just new colors or something like that, but I figured I'd get some and we'd check it out. Let's see what is in the box. Oh, I've got, oh, I actually have a handwritten thank you on my packing slip. That's cool. I don't normally see that from Michael's. I'm gonna move my water. I got a drink of my water. Okay. Ah, oh, okay. Let's see. What do we have here? Uh, so what I ordered for my project, I needed the white. So I got just loops and threads, soft classic white, 350 yards, 7 ounces, 324 meters, 100 grams. It's a medium for 100% acrylic, machine wash cold. Gentle cycle, do not bleach, tumble dry low, do not iron, five millimeter knitting needles and crochet hook made in Turkey. So just some plain white. I think I got four of the whites. Now I only need one white to finish the project, but white is actually not something I tend to keep in my stash. So I thought I'd grab a few more in case this experiment works out well and I want to try it again. I also grabbed two in black because I do have a bit more black in the stash, but I also figured, oh no, oh, you can't have, <coughs> can't quite have too many of those. Okay. So that is the reason I went to Michael's. The rest of this box is the fun stuff. So what did I get here? Um, these are way tinier than I thought they were going to be. Loops and Threads Silky Soft Rayon from Bamboo. What? Um, so I had not seen this before. So I thought I'd give it a look-see. It's a lightweight three. That is one tiny three. That's more of a two in my mind. Um, of course, I haven't used it yet, so I don't know. Uh, four millimeter knitting needle, four millimeter crochet hook, 100% rayon from bamboo. It is a very silky soft. It is. This colorway is cranberry. 240 yards and 3.5 ounces, which is 219 meters and 100 grams. Made in China. So I got four of these. She gives me about a thousand yards of it. I got it in the red, and then I also got two in this pretty um, teal turquoise color. It is named Deep Lake. That's pretty. It is, uh, it's not quite as dark as it's showing up on my screen. It's a little lighter. Okay. And then, okay, so these are not new. It looked like it had a different construction in my mind. Um, but no, they're exactly the same. Uh, um, it's the Loops and Threads Flex. I like flecky yarn. This is silky soft. Um, the pink colorway is pink lemonade. It's a medium four, 79% acrylic, 21% polyester. 355 yards in 6.5 ounces. It, it's very soft. It's very, um, 
it's very silky smooth. Uh, machine, it's, I'm sorry, it's hand wash gold, non-chlorine bleach only, dry flat, do not iron, made in China. So I got pink lemonade, and then I got this one, which is river rock. And it's kind of a sage green with green, blue, and pink flecks. And this one is a light pink. Oh, maybe there's some yellow in the yarn too. And then it's got pink, darker pink, and yellow flecks in it. So that's pretty. And then this was new to me as well. Um, Loops and Threads Bulky Twist. That's so pretty. It's um, 130 yards, 2.9 ounces, uh, 119 meters, 85 grams. They say it's a bulky 5. This, again, looks like a, a thinner 5, but... I'll be interested in using it to see how it works up. They want you to use a 6.5 millimeter knitting needle and 6.5 millimeter crochet hook, which is more akin to what I would use with a yarn like this. 50% um, cotton, 50% acrylic, machine wash, warm, gentle cycle, non-chlorine bleach only, dry flat, iron medium, made in Turkey. This colorway, did I say? Fireside Multi, that's beautiful. And I also got this colorway, which is fruit salad multi that's pretty that is pretty and then i got one other that looked new to me loops and threads impeccable but this had a different name this just says impeccable um it was like moulin yeah m u I'm sorry, M-O-U-L-I-N-E, Moulin Yarn. It doesn't say Moulin on the label, um, but it's kind of this, it's got four, four plies twisted. Two plies are one color, one ply is another color, and one ply is a third color. It's very pretty. I really like it. Um, it is 180 yards and three ounces. Um, medium four, five millimeter knitting needles and crochet hook, 100% acrylic. Did I say that already? Machine wash warm, permanent press, non-chlorine bleach only, tumble dry low, gentle cycle, do not iron, do not dry clean. Made in Turkey. It's very, very soft. Very soft. This is called Fern Moulin. It's Fern Moulin. That's beautiful. And then I also got it in this purple color. And this, though... So the, oh no, it is three different shades of purple. Yeah, it is. Um, this one is called Lavender Moulin. Lavender Moulin. That is very, very pretty. And I'm going to be absolutely honest. I have no idea when this is going to come out. So I'm going to say this now, and then I will come back later and add to the end of this episode to give you the dates um actually no i'm gonna just come back and add at the end everything else i was gonna say okay so let me know if you've tried this yarn i'm not even going to that because i'm gonna come back i will see you soon bye and I am back. I have consulted a calendar and am more combobulated. So what I'm going to do is I have a bunch of this stuff that... Oh, shoot. Okay, it didn't spill. That was my water cup. Um, that I am, of course, not going to use all this yarn. I bought some to share. And I am going to post this video on Monday, February 12th. So in case you're curious, I've got this Loops and Threads, the Flex... So when I saw the picture of it, I thought this was a different construction of the flex I tried in the past. It is not. So I'm just going to give away both these colorways. I was going to keep one and test it, but they look exactly the same. So both of them are going in the giveaway. And then I'm going to give away the green of this Moulin. And then I've got the, uh, what is this, fruit? Fruit something. Fruit salad. <laughs> that one is going in and then the two of the teal bamboos that's all going to go in the giveaway so someone else can try some of the new stuff and see how they like it as well um like i said this all looked new to me and it was marked new but some of them like the the uh, flex there i think was just a different colorway 
and not necessarily a whole new variety of yarn or maybe they got rid of the flex and brought it back i'm not sure anyway so this is open worldwide void were prohibited this was all just me buying some new yarn to look at and share um i have got a lot of yarn reviews on the table i don't know which of these i'll be reviewing or not um let me know if in your opinion these these are new yarns or if they're just new colorways and i got a little confused i could have been confused <laughs> let's be honest um um, so YouTube, Michaels, no one else is associated. It's just me having fun trying to share some stuff. Um, what else? Uh, I did, uh, I pay for shipping. Everything else is on the recipient. You have to be 18 years or older, according to YouTube, to enter giveaways. Um, beware spammer scammers. I do these as hidden giveaways to try to avoid them. And it's been working, but you never know when they'll come back. So... You'll know you won when I post a video stating the winner. There's no other way. There's no, don't telegraph me. Don't give anyone your information until you see me posting a video asking specifically for your information. Um, I will leave this open for one week and draw a winner on the 12th. That will make it the 19th, correct? Yep, February 19th. Monday, February 19th. Sometime after 5 p.m., but... Sometimes it's closer to nine because it's usually after the kiddos go to bed. Oh, I'm chilly today. Um, what else do I need to say? I feel like I'm forgetting something. Oh, you need a keyword. What are you going to put in your comment? Let's use fruit salad. Because that yarn being called fruit salad is very strange to me. So, fruit salad. <laughs> it's weird. It's probably going to include people in that something strange is in the video, but that's okay. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to shuffle around some videos and put this up on the 12th of February. And we'll start then, and we will see who wins a week later. Um, uh, everything's going to be in the description box, so if I forget anything, it'll be down there. Oh, we are a pet-friendly home. We have two cats and two dogs, but non-smoking. So just keep that in mind if you are severely allergic that we do have animals in the house. Um, okay, I believe that is all, and I am going to talk to you later.